I don't want her to be another statistic. Roxana, who requested we not use her last name, calls her mom Superwoman for so many reasons. An immigrant fleeing the war in Vietnam for a better life, she had no idea what living in Oakland would be like. She's been robbed many times. She's been punched. <laughs> they, they, they grabbed a necklace from her on the street. She's gone through all of that, but this is the scariest moment in her life because she almost died. On August 17th, just days before her 61st birthday, Roxana's mom was sleeping alongside her husband in their little Saigon home when gunshots rang out. You can still see to this day a neighboring house riddled with bullet holes. That gut instinct that you have to go or else your life is going to be in danger, mm -hmm. that she knew. Mm -hmm. That's why she was like, we got to go now, we got to go now. She was so scared. These photos are difficult to process. They illustrate the three rounds that went into her back and torso. She still has all the bullet fragments inside her. It's embedded deep inside. We can't do anything about it. She's in constant pain. Like We just want her to get better. What happened to Roxana's mom came shortly after Uber driver Patrick Fung was murdered, not far from the neighborhood. Dentist Lily Sue was also gunned down blocks away in Little Saigon. Too close for comfort and the reason Roxana does not want her mom's story to be forgotten. Like they don't know that this is our lives we're talking about. I would say it's more than hell. It's a living nightmare. Overwhelmed by medical bills and her own back pain that was exacerbated from the stress of caring for her family, Roxana has set up a GoFundMe. She isn't sure what the answer is, but feels stuck and makes this plea for change. We've all grew up there, we all live there, and my mom doesn't want to leave. This is all she knows. She loves Oakland. She still loves it. Of course, she still does. You know, despite being robbed so many times, despite her almost losing her life, she still wants to be here. She still wants to be a part of Oakland. We just want her to get better. In Oakland, Dion Lim, ABC7 News.